Hey dads, lads, and lasses, it is Rogue Bear here today, and in this video we're playing Potion Craft, and I just want to apologize right out the gate if my microphone sounds like butthole. I'm sorry, I was screwing with settings before the stream, and it might sound awful, and it might, you know, next video I will work on it. But anyways, this video is a game where you make potions, so you can be a potion seller. But, um, yeah, I just bought this on Steam today, and this game came out, I think, a few months ago. I'm a little bit late to the party, but I've loved the, you know, the art style here. As you guys can see, it's very unique. And, uh, we should do the tutorial. <laughs> the story begins. You're a novice alchemist wandering the world in search of your destiny. After a long journey, you have finally found a place to apply your trade. You found an abandoned house on the edge of town. Judging by the alchemy equipment and garden, the former owner seems to have practiced alchemy. Apparently, a wizard used to live here, but the layer of dust and condition of the house suggests that it has been empty for a long time. Also, I'm just getting over COVID. Not really, I still have it. So, my voice sounds also really weird, and I might cough a lot, so I'm sorry in advance. <coughs> just like that. Wow, he kind of predicted it. Anyways, you decide to turn uh, the house into a potion shop. Potion seller. After several days of cleaning and preparing, the shop is ready for its first customers. It's, uh, blah, blah, blah. it's time to remember your alchemy skills and start this new life in a new town. That's what I would love to do, start a new life in a new town, man. That sounds like so much fun. Rewriting your slate. Anyways. Potions are made from ingredients. Take two terrarias, or terrarias, and two water bloom from your inventory and throw them into the cauldron. To move ingredients, click and move the mouse. Yeah, drag and let them go. So, I've seen some gameplay of this, guys, and whenever you see it moves the path that we take, depending on what resource we use. So you see some send us down the map, and some send us to the right, and some like make squiggles while some are like more zigzags. Yeah, it's really cool. You, you'll see more when we get into it, but I think we're gonna use the water bloom. And then we'll use this again, because why not? I don't really know what I'm doing yet, because we don't have the map unlocked, we're just kind of walking anywhere. After adding the potions, you can stir it, use the spoon to stir. Just drag that stuff around. Now the potion icon is touching an unknown effect. To find out what the effect does, you need to add it to your current position. Potion. <laughs> to add the effect of the potion, you need to bring the water in the cauldron to a boil. Use the bells to blow on the coal and heat the cauldron. How hot do I want this though? Healing! Perfect, you've added a new effect, healing, to make the potion finish potion. Grinding ingredients in the molten pestle. Uh, take it- Okay, let me see here. You can use the molten pestle to grind out practically any ingredient and unlock their potential. This helps you create the same potion using fewer ingredients. Try to create the same potion using just one terraria and one water bloom. So it makes it more potent. <laughs> That's what it's saying. Alright, so we want to put it in here. We want to... Man, that is so satisfying. So you add the ground terrarium, terraria, to the cauldron. And we've got both of those, it looks like. Completely grind the water bloom using the mortar and pestle. I love the art style so much, guys. Oh my gosh. And I love the little detail of the color of the water bloom is left on the pestle. Or the mortar. I don't know which one's which, actually. I don't know which one's the mortar or the pestle. Alright, cool. And then we stir in our pot. Bum, 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 bum. And we heat it. Boom, 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 boom. Saving a potion recipe. Excellent, you have made the same very potion, very same potion, but uses half of your ingredients. <coughs> your first potion attempt won't always be the most optimal, so experiment and, perf and perfect it. If you're happy with the potion you made, save it in the recipe book. Then you can make that potion in the future with the click of a button. Nicely done. Uh, finish the potion. Moving between rooms, you're the owner of the potion shop, and your task is not only to brew potions and sell them to customers, uh, but also sell them, yeah. So you can use WASD. Or I'm sure you can click these buttons here. Offering potions for sale. Every day, people from all over town, and even from other towns, will stop and buy various magic potions. Potions, Santa. <laughs> 
I require only your strongest potions. You cannot handle my strongest potions, traveler. Yeah, anyways. <laughs> I'm gonna reference that a lot in this in this video series. Jabs the brew potion in the laboratory and sell them to customers. Many potions will be brewed for a specific purpose, but as I got idea to keep a few in hand. Okay, good to know. Offer a potion to the right side. The amount of gold you will receive from selling potions shown in the sell button. Alright, so there's no difference. How you make it, it's just the potion you result with. So this is a weak potion of healing one. My husband's been ill, has recently gotten worse. He can't get up, he has a fever and sweat, so you need a potion that will help my husband. Cool, so you get two star and two handsome men. <laughs> To make more money on a potion, you can try to haggle. Successful haggling could significantly increase the price of potion, but unsuccessful could do the opposite. So that one star, we got two stars from that last one. Uh oh. Try haggling for a better price. Oh, I didn't know that's how you finish the haggle. Well, I know better for next time, guys. I learned how to haggle. Lack of suitable potions. You will f uh, I don't have a potion ready for certain customers. Go back to laboratory. There's no there's no time limit. I love that. There's no time limit because like most games give you a lot of anxiety with like customers coming in and go to the garden. Man, that is so beautiful. I love this so much, guys. All right. Every day, new herbs and mushrooms will grow in the garden. Don't forget to pick them from time to time. New potion. The customer needs poison, which means you will need to create a potion with the poison effect. You will have to look for most of the ingredients, I mean, most of the effects on your own throughout the map. You remember from your alchemy lessons. One terraria and one fireball. I'm gonna, I think maybe we're supposed to mash it up. I don't know, if we're not, I'm sorry, guys. Oh yeah, I did it right. You can see we just landed. Oh, that is so cool! However potent- yeah, that's a zigzag there pattern you guys can see. So let's mix that around. I didn't- <laughs> I didn't make it. Gosh dang it! Yeah, I didn't see that it wasn't fully ground. There, we should make it this time. Yeah, you have to fully grind it, and I did not. Da 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 da. Am I on it this time? There, I made it this time. Finish making the potion. Potion salad. I should. I want to save the recipe, but I. I think I should save it. All right, let's go sell this. Let's haggle. Now that I know how to haggle. Dang, we got, what, two extra dollar? I'll take money. Once the last customer leaves the shop, you can have a rest in your bedroom, and it's located above the laboratory. Man, I love this game so much. Click on the bed and confirm you want to end the day. Hey, when we get all this ingredient... Whoa, 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 whoa! Excellent, you refresh your alchemy knowledge and familiarize yourself with the alchemy equipment in the attic next to the bed. Found a few ingredients in a ladle for water. Let's do it! Alright, so what do we got coming on? What do you want? A fire potion? I don't know how to make that. That's poison, that's healing. I'm assuming fire's in the top somewhere. Let's try a fire bell and a wind bloom. I have a feeling that's gonna be something new. Okay. Let's actually see where that takes us first. I mean, we're getting so many achievements, bro. Wow. Let's just put this in and see where it takes us, because I have no idea. This is experimentation, guys. 
put us in a whirlpool? Where are we? <laughs> I don't know what this is. Am I able to... Fire this? Okay, cool, because I wanted to see where this would take us. Oh, wow! This is actually sick. Okay, so let's go up here. I see a potion over there. If I put in a water bloom and I'm like, hey, we need to go right there. That's where I want to go exactly. What kind of potion is this? Swift this! Well, that's not what I wanted. Um... Let's try shooting out straight left. Let's see what's out left, guys. Smash! Smash! Smash it! Mash! Alright, I'm, I'm getting a little crazy. I like the physics, though. Let's pop another one. Let's see where we end up. Aha, that's gotta be a fire potion. Tell me it ain't. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. Let's get our fire potion. Yeah, I figured it would be using the fire bell. Okay, finished potion. Let's actually grab our ingredients. Is that all of them for today? It looks like that's all of them. Also, I'm like leveling up like mad. Ooh! This is cool. You can haggle on hard, very hard. Additional bonuses. I don't know what I should upgrade. Increase the radius. Additional bonuses appear in the alchemy mod that give experience points. Huh. I don't know what to do yet, so I'm just not going to do anything. Let's go sell this fire potion, though. Let's haggle, because we're little, we're little dwarves. There we go, 50 coin. That's a lot. Greetings, I went fishing in a lake in the forest. I cast my line out and immediately got a bite. I reeled it in and tried to get it off the hook where that fish had some teeth. Oh, he needs some healing potions. Where can I look at my saved potions? Yeah, where do I access that actually? I mean, I know how to make it, but like, I'm trying to make it without... Oh, you can zoom out that way. We got a big map to explore, kids. You know, I'll figure this out. Oh, so that's how you level up and stuff. There! Brew this recipe. Okay, well that was easy. Yeah, let's just haggle everything because we're little dwarves. With little with little goblin and energies. Yeah, two two dollars. Oh, I like her aesthetic with the uh, lavender and stuff. You're the new alchemist. I'm a local herbalist. I gather plants and sell them. Want to see what I have for sale? I would love to buy. 
I'll buy your life leaf just because it looks cheaper than usual. That's expensive. I only have so much muns. <laughs> oh, I can haggle the herbalist. Let's go. I'll buy three of those, but I'm going to haggle the heck out of you. Man, that saves a lot. That saves seven coins. Thank you, herbalist lady. How can I leave now? Go away. Do you sell anything besides herbs? Flowers, herbs, roots, and various berries. Thank you, miss. I'm feeling itchy. <laughs> well, down there, know what I mean? I'm assuming he wants a healing potion. And I totally remember how to get to that. I actually just randomly clicked something and it worked out. Okay, exit. Take this healing potion, this should help you. Popularity level. Nice, good afternoon. Yesterday at a friend's party, I burned my tongue in some hot soup and he needs a healing potion again. All right, let's remember how to do the healing potion. So if I check here, it is one terraria and one water bloom. A terraria and a water bloom. I just want to get good at making things manually, so whenever I'm not able to... Like, because I can't save every recipe in the game. So I gotta get good at actually just making them myself. Alright, there we go. Finish potion. Hello, Saya. Alright, that's the guy that itched his nuts. That's, that's a different guy. I don't know how to use a tinderbox since I can use the... Man, you people are stupid. How many of these do I gotta use? Because I'm going to run out of fire bell if I keep having to make this every five seconds. I don't want to use three fire bell every time I need to. There's nothing else that goes left yet. I have to. That's a shame. Oh, well. Yeah, I got to. Bada bing, bada boom. The fart sound. Finish potion. Is this the last customer, I think? I'm definitely gonna haggle you. This is expensive. Here we go. We're getting some money. We profited, like... Some money. Ooh, learn a new town. Go to the basement. This alchemy machine is bad, badly damaged. Find a merchant who can sell you parts for a new alchemy machine. That's so cool. Reagent for creating albedo and void salt. This is so complicated. So I, I yeah, I'm nowhere close to making that yet. I'm not gonna worry. Let's actually do the talents now because I feel like that's gonna help us. Well, I got haggling. I feel like that wasn't the smartest thing to upgrade, but oh well. <laughs> oh well, chat, what are you gonna do? <sighs> Another day at the office. Is that all I got? Yeah, that's everything, I think. All right, let's see what you people need. Uh, healing? You people suck. <laughs> you guys suck. Maybe do something to not get yourselves killed. You wiener schnitzels. Man, is this satisfying, though. Wow, would you want Alright. A healing potion, sir? 
sleeping draught? I don't know how to make a sleeping potion. All I know is poison. Okay, let's go in this portal down here. Do we have what's straight down? Oh, I forget what this ingredient's even called. What is it called? Terraria. Terravia. Alright, let's... Actually, let's just throw it in like that. And then we go foosh, 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 foosh. Wow, that really helped. <laughs> Here's another Terraria. There. There we go! Let's finish that potion. What is it? Strength! I mean, that's cool and all, but... It's not exactly what I needed. It's, it's, it's nowhere close to what I need. I need the opposite of that potion. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. Let's try some of these new potions. What's one that shoots me far down to the left? So thorn stick can actually make poison immediately with just one thorn stick. Which that's awesome. So let's throw thorn stick in here and just completely mash that up. I just want to like see the map a little bit. Is something that can shoot me? Firebell could work. Yeah, screw it. I'm just trying to explore the map a bit. Am I allowed to do this? I certainly hope it's not gonna be like, oh, there's a wall next to you, you can't use this. Bro! I didn't mean to scream. I'm gonna scream anyways, I'm upset now. Let's go upright, we haven't done that yet. <laughs> This is fun though, man. I feel like a whimsical little creature is what I feel like. A dubious little creature. That's what I feel like. Um, let's go right. Yeah, water, water blossom, whatever it's called. Kimchi. Oh, this sucks. I'm gonna have to waste. I don't have an upright ingredient yet, so I'm gonna have to waste a wind blossom, whatever this is. Let's actually just stop it there. I don't trust that wall. Then we'll have to go right. Man, this sucks. <laughs> I wanna figure out how to make a potion of sleeping, man. Like, just go to bed on time. Ooh, new potion. Can I reach it with a good old. Are you, are you, I better be able to reach that or else I'm gonna throw swear words. Fart. I hate myself. I. You know, guys. I'm not the greatest alchemist. Let this be known, guys. Mana! Bro, I am like making all the wrong stuff. I guess we go more right. Like, shoot in here. I don't really know where else I'm going. Well, if we think about it, the fire... The fire bell made fire. The water bloom should make water. Like, some kind of water potion. So if we keep shooting right, we should see something water-oriented. Please don't shatter my potion. So what do you... Like, water... Frost. I mean, that makes sense. I, I would, I would, I would wager that would make sense. I mean, we're making a whole bunch of potions. So look at us go, guys. We are so little. We're a little dubious. So we have two points. Ten percent more profitable bonus spawn. Ten percent. We should get some radius because I can't see fart, bro. We'll work on our radius a little bit. 
and then we'll start, um, start something else, I don't know. Let's try to go past healing. Where, Life Leaf, Life Leaf is good. I haven't used this one before. Maybe this will give us, like, something past healing is what we need, so... Let's take this portal. Screw all this life leaf we have, we're gonna use all of it, pretty much. <laughs> oh, there's a potion there, though. If I wanna get to the- Ooh, I can use my water bloom! Let's go! This is fun. Big dubious little elf making potions. Wild growth? Dude, what? Okay, wild growth. Well, that means there's something past poison. Which I would have seen if I didn't get, if I didn't smack right into the wall. Let's just go straight down then. But yeah, I'm probably gonna have to end this episode soon, guys. Considering I have no idea what time I'm at. Let me check. We'll make one more potion, and then I'll call it. We'll, we'll discover one more potion. Because we're just very dubious. I want to use that one, but I don't want to... Well, one, it's my last one. And two, I don't know if there's a wall there. I don't want to risk it yet. So we'll take it slowly. Just smash it down here. Yeah, there is a wall here. Let's just keep heading down. Let's just discover what's down here. Gotta learn sometime. New potion there. Can I re- Ooh, I'll hit a wall. I don't wanna have to- I don't wanna have to waste a life leaf. But I might have to. Yeah, unfortunately, we're just gonna have to. We're just kind of trying to discover the map right now. So what can I use to grab this? Obviously, I can use... Is that even gonna reach it? I could use Water Blossom. I'm gonna try this. All right, right there. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Stone skin. Cool, man. Well, unfortunately, we've gotten absolutely nothing that we need yet. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, we have gotten no sleep potion, and I need poisoning, too. Does it tell me how to do it? No, it does not tell me how to make a po Oh. I'm so stupid. That's poison. Bro, tell me I'm stupid without telling me I'm stupid. I'm like trying to discover like, where is the poison potion? It's like right there, bro. There we go. Chapter one is done. Good job, you complete the chapter with each new uh, chapter, new visitors, order types, potion, basis, merchants, and purchasable items appear. Continue to complete the goals in the alchemist path to unlock the full potential of your alchemy equipment. <laughs> to learn all the secrets of the trade. Well, that's awesome. I feel good about myself. So next episode, guys, we'll do chapter two. Pour water from the ladle to move the potion towards the center. Then, ooh, we will try that. Explosion, dexterity, population four, save a recipe. Two effects? Oh, we are so gonna try this, guys. Anyways, yeah, thank you all for watching. If you guys like this series, leave a like. And I'll be playing more of this on my channel, so look out for that. Yeah, thank you guys very much, and I'll catch you in the next one. See you!